Hi, welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to insert, customise and delete bullet points. So I've got a regular document up here. I'm going to be showing you how to insert bullet points to this section here. But if you're just typing in a regular document and you want to insert some bullet points, let's say after this paragraph here, place your cursor here, press the return key, press it twice if you want the bullet point to have a space in between, go up to this icon here and click on the drop down. Here you can select from a number of different bullet points. So I'm just going to select the top one here and you can see we've now inserted our first bullet point. If you begin to type and you finish your bullet point, press the return key and you can see another bullet point is produced. Go on to type your next sentence and once you've finished you can press the return key, press it one more time and then it will delete the last bullet point. If you then press the delete button, it will make sure that that last paragraph one line up to create an equal space between the top and the bottom. If you've missed a bullet point, you can simply go to the top bullet point, press the enter key, and you can see that that one has now been inserted for another bullet point. If you're not sure that you like this section of bullet points, you can always select them all go up to this icon here, which are numbers, click on the drop down, and you can select from any number of these options. So I'll select the recently used. It will simply change the icons to numbers. And once again, if you've missed out a bullet point, don't worry, if you just hit the return key, Word will sort it out and renumber all of the bullet points. If you want bullet points that aren't indented, that means uh, there's a space between the edge of the paragraph margin and your bullet points. You can always select all of the bullet points. Go up to your ruler at the top here. If you can't see the ruler, go to view and then make sure that ruler is checked. And you can see we've got two little triangles. If you move the top triangle, you'll move the actual numbers or bullet points. If you move the bottom triangle, you'll be moving the actual text, which gives you the flexibility to place these bullets wherever you like. Now for these points at the bottom, I've got several different lines of text. You can simply select them all, go to the Home tab, and you can select from the bullet points all the numbers, and just click, and once again, Word will go ahead and renumber all of your lines of text. Now, if you want to delete any of your bullet points, just simply click on the text beforehand. You can either go to the top here and just click on the icon and it will remove it for you, or you can simply press the delete key and then press it one more time and it will send it back to line up with the margin. Once again, if you feel like changing all of the numbers to icons, simply select your bullet points, go up to this icon here, you can just click and it will change those to those dots. So I hope that's helped you today. If it has, please like and subscribe and have a great day.